Hey friends, it's Fuller Farm. We're down here in the water closet with an update on the aquaponics. The rainbow trout have now been in here almost a week. They're doing great. We haven't lost any trout yet, so that's awesome. They're very hungry whenever I put food in there. We're feeding them morning and then evening. And we also have our first harvest. So just plucked off a bunch of bok choy and here's the result quite a bit in there also want to show you over here you can see these are our first flowers from our strawberry plant there's one there's one back here and three little flowers and i think there's probably back here there might be one or two blossoms as well so everything's doing great the bok choy took off and it's growing really well. On the front of the netting, I've just added this clip just to keep the netting in place. And we'll go and throw in some feed so you can see how aggressive these guys are. Here we go, I've got this little handful of food. You can see how aggressive these guys go after food. They're a lot of fun to watch feed. Give them a little bit more. I also want to show you if you'll notice there's a light source over there on the side of the IBC tote that's letting light in for these guys. Let me show you how I set that up. All I did was buy a little fluorescent grow light from Walmart. It's called Lights of America. It's like eight or nine dollars. It's a 24 inch light. And that light is just hanging on the side of the aquaponic setup. So it's just down there on the side, just sitting. And that helps light up the tote down here for the fish. What exactly is aquaponics? First, I think we need to define a couple of other items. You may have heard of hydroponics. So hydroponics is growing plants straight in the water using nutrients that you put into the water. And then you have aquaculture, which you've heard of, which is really uh, fish farming. So it's raising fish and uh, big runs or tanks uh, like tilapia or trout so fish farming even shrimp prawns uh, those are farmed quite a bit that's really big in Asia so aquaponics is actually a combination of the two now with hydroponics you're adding chemicals or nutrients into the water directly with aquaponics the only input should be the fish food and then the bacteria are converting that into uh, basically a fertilizer, nitrogen, that the, that the plants can uptake. So you've got hydroponics, which is straight in the water. You have aquaculture, which is really fish farming. And then you have aquaponics, which is a combination of the two. So it's growing plants and fish together in the same closed loop system. So the rainbow trout are doing really good. I would like to see the water clear up some more, but the ammonia, the nitrite are, are really low, and the nitrates, which are good for the plants, are right on target. Now if we head up here to the top, to the grow bed, you can see that this lettuce has grown really big. We're actually gonna harvest a lot of this lettuce today to use in salad. You can see they're just doing great. Strawberries, you can see there's a little tiny berry there, there's a couple of berries and flowers on the strawberries. There's this awesome little tomato plant over here that is just uh, starting to take off. This is a little grape tomato or jelly bean tomato plant. And there's some other ones over here. I just harvested a ton of lettuce from the romaine and the bib lettuce. And there's one thing I just learned is that I like picking the lettuce 
from these that aren't in the cups. It's a lot easier to get down to the bottom compared to these that are in the cups. So I think going forward, I'm just going to grow the lettuce right in the rock media. Um, now, the cups do help contain the roots a little bit when you decide to take it out. But I'm still, I'm going to go with just right in the rocks. Again, it's really easy to take off the, the lettuce. And this will now regrow. Even though I've picked everything, it'll just grow in more lettuce for us. Can we just have like a salad or something? So the aquaponics is doing great. We still have all the trout and the plants are still taking off. We've already harvested quite a bit of the chives. Uh, we've harvested already a batch of bok choy and it's ready to harvest again. So doing awesome. Anyways, leave us a comment down below. Anything else you'd like to know or see about our aquaponics setup, let us know in the comments. Thanks and have a great day.